We're suffering through a litany of problems right now. Inflation through the roof, feckless government officials, and a country on the brink of a collapse not seen since the fall of the Roman Empire. Yet the worst, most insidious dilemma we face is that of the faceless. It seems another masked vigilante is bringing their illegitimate justice to the streets. All reports indicate an individual disguised in purple and sporting a take-no-prisoners approach to the illegal activities they perpetrate. Some of you have criticized the Spider-Man for not going far enough. But I can't believe what I'm saying. That's not in their jurisdiction. While they shouldn't be out there in the first place, at least they haven't sworn themselves as judge, jury, and executioner. We have systems in place for this people. If this new hero really wanted to enforce order to the fullest extent of the law, they join the police department. Why is it so hard for some people to follow the rules? This is the chaos the Spider-Men inspire. And why must I be the sentinel of statutes? Now how about some ads? A team name. Pete didn't mention Spider Pals? the chance.
reinforcements? Really? Couldn't handle me yourselves? Had a chance. <laughs> I've spotted something. Hunters on this rooftop that I thought. I heard you challenged Craven once. <laughs> Is that actually true? A few years ago, I was stupid. I didn't understand what he was trying to mold us into. He struck me down. Was a pup. But you lived. Only because I nicked him with a pup. You're done, Hunters! <laughs> <laughs> on the blind later.
This is always a handy place to change. This will make such a difference for the community. Thank you so much for your support. Okay, bye-bye. Miles. Hey, Ma. Mm. Babe, siéntate. <laughs> I just wanted to check in. See how you're doing. Todo bien? Mm. Fine. Everything's good. <sighs> okay. It's just a lot right now. So much to take care of in the city. Super stressed about my college essay. Pete's busy doing other stuff. And Lee. Lee is still out there. Doesn't that bother you? Of course it bothers me. But I'm committed to making this community better. I've got to let go of things that don't serve me and focus on where I want to go, not where I've been. ¿Entiendes lo que te digo? Yeah. But Lee? I can't just let him go. Angela, I'm gonna have to call you back. No, how can you be locked out? You have a key. Oh. No, no, I, I understand the urgency. Uh, let me make some calls. Okay. Mom, do you need me to go? Didn't you just finish telling me how busy you are? Yeah, but I always have time for my community. Okay, Ma, where am I headed? Harlem Cultural Center, 116th and Convent. That was my friend Angela on the phone. She's the curator, and she's trying to give a prospective donor a private tour. But the security system locked her out. Whoops, awkward. Angela lined up a bunch of items for a new music exhibit, but funding fell through. And if this donor doesn't cover the costs, the museum might have to close. I'll make sure they get in. I'm passionate about preserving the musical heritage of this community. But how can I donate to a museum where the security system isn't even functional? Darren, I hear your concerns, but I assure you this museum will... Spider-Man. Oh, thank God. The system's locked us out and it's not responding to any input at all. Let's see if I can figure out what's wrong with it. Need to find the control panel. Let's just start up on the roof. Old trucks, faded paint. Guess it makes sense for a museum. Control panel. Relays are overloaded. Gotta get inside the walls to fix them. Let's patch things up so Angela can give that tour. It must have been a power surge or something. Who are these guys? The EMP took out the whole system. We're all alone in the air. Just need to break this padlock and we're in. That's how Angela got locked out. Better reset the system so I can get in there and stop these guys. Hmm, not too bad. Let me fix it up real quick. Got it. 
But the system's still down. Gotta find the other relay boxes. Hey, Miles. I checked in with all the feast shelters. No one has seen Martin Lee. <sighs> Thanks. Can't believe I let him get away when I could have. You know? Could have what? Made sure he didn't hurt anyone else. Right. Well, don't worry. I'll keep looking. some valuable stuff in here. These guys seem like pros. Get this back online. Nice. But the system's still down. There must be more relays. Sax and Drum are already in the truck, right? Yeah, but we got time and a lot more room in the truck. Gotta get past these guys without being spotted. How about a distraction in the key of C? A spider robot! Shoot it! Distraction in the key of C. Keep it together, man. Don't you punk out on me. You could do this. I've never been above that guy. Miles, everything okay? I ran into a snag, but I'm handling it. While you're there, check out some of the instruments. Get you ready for college. Ma, I'm going into music tech. Computers are my instruments. Music starts with a human, their instrument and their soul. When you're mixing or sampling, you have to listen close and capture that soul. Computers can't do that. You know how old you sound right now? Old and wise, you mean? stronger signal now. Looks like there's one more relay to bring back online. Oh, man. Gotta get all the way across the room. How much time we got? A couple minutes. Grab the last few things and get ready to load. 
Who's playing music? Someone bumping into things. Guys will get away with any of this stuff. Abort! Let's roll! Nice work, Spatterbot. Now it's my turn. Spider-Man, the front door's finally open. But there is a bunch of stuff missing. It's all out back in the loading docks. And I'll make sure it stays there. Let's get out of here, quick! Go, go, go! Oh, yeah. This will be an in and out job. Now Spider-Man's here! Tell your boss, don't go messing with my neighborhood! Got a gift for you, Spidey! Meet at the rendezvous point you now. Not today. <laughs> Gotta stop those trucks. Pick one for now. Give it up, guys. You're not getting away. Funky drummer. They only recovered items from one truck? What a mess. Sorry, Angela. This is a deal breaker. There goes our best hope for a big donor. There's still the fundraising gala. If we don't find that second truck, there is no exhibit. 
Without an exhibit, there is no gala. Without a gala, the museum will have to close. That won't happen. I promise. Here. <gasps> this belonged to Clyde Stubblefield. Ooh, the original funky drummer. <laughs> Do you know how often his rhythms were sampled? He was so influential, a direct line from funk to hip hop. <laughs> Thank you. And don't worry, I'll find the rest of those items. Thank you. I should check in with Pete. calling. I have to take this. Catch up later? Oh, uh, sure, man. Later. Hey, Pete. I'm at EMF. No sign of Doc Connors yet, but I could use an extra set of eyes. On my way. Have you heard anything from MJ? You said she's stopping by his house, right? Nothing yet. She told me she'd call when she got there. Let's hope he's just taking a sick day. Yeah, definitely. I'm gonna check her office. Just come by when you can. kid painted this. I remember her showing me a sketch of it the day before it went up. New York is nothing without its people. Jonah? Parker, put me down! Hey, get this. It looks like these imposter spider bots are getting pinged by some third party. Like someone else is tracking them? Exactly. I just need to figure out who. Collect any others you can find. I need all the data I can get. Nice one, Genki. Got us one step closer to solving this thing. a very special episode for you today. Here to dish about all things going on in Harlem recently is the incredible and brilliant Councilwoman Rio Morales. Good to have you back, Rio. Good to be back, Danica. So, we've been seeing reports of an attempted robbery in Harlem? Unfortunately. But the Harlem Cultural Center is home to artifacts from resilient musicians of color. What better way to honor them than to be equally resilient? We'll recover just fine. If there's one thing I love, it's optimism. There! Take him out! Head enforcement here. You're in violation of several ordinances. Hey! It's the Fun Brigade! That's 
of them? Beautiful. Any sign of Connors? Nothing yet. It's MJ. Bad news. Connors' house is crawling with hunters and the doctor's MIA. Good news. I think I know where to find him. Somewhere across the river. Maybe around. Let's move. He's okay. waiting. Sable paid off sooner than I'd hoped. A zoo. Connors has to be around here somewhere. I have to tell Pete. That window looks open. The light. Where is that van? his reptile genes. They've been studying Dr. Connors. Oh God, they want to hunt him too. must be lit. Everyone will be A lot of hunters in there. After all this time, perhaps he will finally get what he has longed for. <sighs> Looks like they've set up shop here. Hmm. Looks right.
Need them to look the other way. You know I don't like being snuck up on. Might get a better view from the roof. in the wrong place, girl. I will put you down humanely. I'm coming for you. So many have tried to kill him, human and beast. I don't believe it's possible. You're right. Buried alive beneath rubble. Grab. On my way there. <sighs> Stand by. I'm investigating. to find Connors. Another night tainted by the silence of death. I wasn't sure I could clip his wings. Perhaps that would be my weakness, but no. Not even that could save him. He's dead. Zoo in Jersey. It's. Please, don't. Please, you don't understand. to get in the cage, and Connor's shackles need that key. Just have to find them. Code. Steal some keys. 
my blades grow. <laughs> Put the rest with a blade to the stem. This one was nearly something when faced with the predator, though. He did not try to prove himself superior. He fought only to survive. It was vicious. Feral. into it. But that code has to be nearby. I've only seen one of Craven's hunts in person. I still have dreams about it. Must be preparing these for Craven. The hunt of a lifetime. One day, with enough training, I aspire to be what he is. If he gets what he hopes for tonight, we will have to take up his mantle. I'll be ready when the time comes. and hear about who Vika is. Simkarian poetry. Must be her first language. Vegre, you'll hear. Her Simkarian is perfect. Hopefully mine is convincing. System. Looks like she's high ranking. Good to know. Radio designations. Let's find out who this mongoose is. Garin, my trusty subordinate. All right, let's get that code. Come on, MJ. Your Simparian is still good. Enough. Just answer. It's Vika. Vika, Mongoosnok. Vika, the tech void. Garin, elegem vana, hiva shaipol. Hol vana, ka kezulekes kodok. 
Okoda, Shorosata, Os Informatio, Stablan, Ban, Tut Hotnad? Te Pedigas Tut Hotnad. Me and Hongon Vesel Hets Velem. Nehiv Turbet. Nerta Feyed Be Keruhet. That felt kind of nice. All right, better move before he comes looking. Where's that whiteboard? There you are. Codes for the enclosure. Got the code. Now for the key. to get Connors out. East to the reptile house. I have to get over there fast. The grads of the insects. There she is. Take her down. Damn it, I lost her. We're gonna find you. I'll see I lost that sight was. of her, but she won't get far. with the keys went this way. Getting close. There. He's got the key. That camo field. I think I can hide behind it. I oh, know it sounds crazy. I can feel the key with us. If the spirits of the dead are so concerning, maybe you should seek another one. They're judging. Cut the keys. Time to get out of here. Stanchions. There's nothing more senses. More hunters. We will have our victory. No matter the cost.
I'm on my way, Doc. This beast. His name is Kurt Connors. He's a good man. There's a lamb in the atrium. Might have a syrup. Syrup! I don't have much time. Then we'll buy you some. Right up the hill. That glass building. Please, hurry. We'll clear a path. Keep your heads down. Don't worry, Doc. We'll get you to that lab. We're not turning tonight. Those hunters must have a death wish. Now the lizard? It seems like they're just doing their bosses dirty work. Their benefits must be crazy. Now look who's joking in a bad time. You're learning! MJ, move ahead but stay low! Blocking our route. They even brought some animals from home. I'm not stopping you. He's not looking good. I can feel it. Please. We're almost there, Doc. Stop us on breathing. Okay. Okay. Eyes on them.
to make an antidote. in fifth grade when you no no you gotta stay awake buddy Wait.
MJ, get him out of here. I'll handle this. MJ, I'm on my way. What are you? Track the lizard. The spider is mine. Stop hovering. I'm fine. Maybe some water. Water. On it. So... The suit cured your... Yeah. Which means without it, you... Yeah. Okay. We gotta figure out how to get this back onto Harry. How did you give it to me? I... I, I don't know, it just... sort of happened. Okay. Uh, let me try. Pete, there's something in here. Uh, uh. Okay, not what I... What the... Uh. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, I'm fine. Let me try it again. Find Dr. Connors. Except <laughs> he's a drilling reptile right now. Craven! The serum! He had it around his neck. That's what he used on Dr. Connors. If we find that serum, we, we could analyze it, use the equipment here to, to engineer a cure. And bring Dr. Connors back from the land of the lizard. I'll start tracking down Craven. He's probably already cleared out of that zoo by now. Well, lucky for us. He left a piece of himself behind. There's this pawn shop in Little Odessa that specializes in rare artifacts, just like this knife. Let's start there. Good thinking. Weirdly enough, I feel energized. It does... It did that for me, too. How does this thing work? Honestly, I can't explain it. I just think the suit listens. Okay! 
Maybe it'll help with finding Craven and his serum. Just don't get stabbed this time, please. I usually try not to. I'll be fine. I promise. Wait, what is that? Looks mysterious. A Mysterium? I should let Miles know. traffic violations and we're gonna have to revoke your license.
sure you've heard by now that Mac Gargan, the scorpion, has been found dead. <laughs> His stinger removed like a trophy. One can only assume this was at the hands of the hunters. Are they doing what the ineffectual Spider-Men won't and removing these dangers permanently? Then again, maybe Spider-Man has finally changed his tune. I, for one, say, let them wipe each other out. They're not making our world a better place, and the less of these mass marauders roaming our streets, the better. When they're gone, we can turn the corner back to simpler times. Wouldn't that be refreshing? I yearn for the days of normal news coverage, when I could attack the real issues, like the tanking economy, for the corruption of our youth. Instead of being forced to cover spandex buffoons who make life for the average Joe a waking nightmare. One day. <laughs> One day. And today's lesson is never send a robot to do a hunter's job. Though I'd beat them too. That should work for Robbie. Say what you will about social media, and I can say a lot. It's helped so many businesses stay afloat here when they would have gone under a long time ago. being attacked. Better hurry. You know, last time I did one of these, I threw out my back. Wait, really? <laughs> Hope you don't mind me interrupting here. You guys use your strength to help others. I'm sure Feast would appreciate the help.
inside? Nope. How is this going to work? Just team up like normal, or...? How long you been tracking these guys? A few weeks. Heard rumors for a while. They leave bodies in their wake. They care a lot about the Crimson Hour, whatever that is. The hot new club in Hell's Kitchen? Wow, that just popped out there, huh? Who says stuff like that? Not me. Left Salma.